Liver disease can be passed through families called inherited. And anything that damages the liver also can cause liver problems, including viruses, alcohol use, excessive usage of over-the-counter medicines like painkillers, and obesity. Over time, conditions that damage the liver can lead to scarring, called cirrhosis. Cirrhosis can lead to liver failure, a life-threatening condition. But early treatment may give the liver time to heal. Liver has the ability to heal on its own if taken care properly. We'll explore 14 critical signs that may indicate severe liver dysfunction or failure, helping you recognize when it's essential to seek medical attention promptly. Dark urine. Dark urine can indicate the presence of bilirubin, a yellow pigment, which may be elevated in liver diseases. When the liver is unable to process bilirubin efficiently, it can accumulate in the urine, giving it a darker color. Pale stool. Stool color is influenced by the presence of bile, so pale or play-colored stool can indicate a lack of bile secretion or flow. This may occur in conditions such as bile duct obstruction or liver diseases affecting bile production. Jaundice. Jaundice occurs when there's an excess of bilirubin in the blood, leading to yellowing of the skin and the whites of the eyes. It can be caused by liver diseases such as hepatitis or cirrhosis, where the liver is unable to process bilirubin effectively, resulting in its accumulation in the body. Abdominal pain or swelling, abdominal discomfort or swelling, particularly in the upper right side, can be a sign of liver inflammation or enlargement. This may occur due to conditions like fatty liver disease, hepatitis, or liver cirrhosis. Nausea and vomiting. Liver diseases can cause nausea and vomiting due to various reasons, including impaired bile flow, accumulation of toxins in the body, or irritation of the stomach lining. These symptoms can be particularly prominent in conditions like acute liver failure or hepatitis. Weight loss. Unexplained weight loss can occur in liver diseases, especially in conditions like liver cirrhosis or advanced hepatitis. This may be due to factors such as reduced nutrient absorption, increased energy expenditure, or loss of muscle mass. Easy bruising, the liver produces proteins involved in blood clotting, so liver diseases can lead to decreased clotting factors and increased susceptibility to bruising and bleeding. Itchy skin, itching, or pruritus, is a common symptom of liver diseases, particularly those that affect bile flow. Accumulation of bile acids in the bloodstream can lead to itching, which is often more pronounced in areas with increased skin moisture, such as the hands and feet. Swelling in the legs and ankles, swelling or edema in the legs and ankles can occur in liver diseases like cirrhosis due to fluid retention caused by increased pressure in the liver's blood vessels, portal hypertension. Confusion or disorientation. Hepatic encephalopathy is a condition characterized by cognitive impairment, confusion, and disorientation, which can occur in advanced liver disease. It results from the buildup of toxins, such as ammonia, in the bloodstream due to impaired liver function. Bleeding. Liver diseases can lead to decreased production of clotting fat can manifest as nosebleeds, easy bruising, or gastrointestinal bleeding which may be severe and require medical attention. Weakness and fatigue. Liver dysfunction can result in weakness and fatigue due to factors such as impaired nutrient metabolism, decreased production of proteins necessary for muscle function, or accumulation of toxins in the body. Liver dysfunction can cause hemorrhoids. The liver produces bile, a substance that helps break down fats in the digestive system. When liver function is impaired, bile production may decrease. Bile plays a role in stimulating peristalsis, the muscular contractions that move stool through the intestines. Reduced bile production can slow down bowel movements, leading to constipation. When you're constipated, passing stool becomes difficult and straining during bowel movements increases. 
This training puts pressure on the veins in the rectal area, which can cause them to swell and become inflamed, leading to hemorrhoids. Loss of appetite, liver diseases can lead to a decreased desire to eat, often due to factors such as nausea, abdominal discomfort, or changes in metabolism. A loss of appetite can contribute to weight loss and malnutrition, further impacting overall health. To maintain your liver health, have a healthy diet. Eat a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins. Limit saturated fats, sugars, and processed foods. Consider reducing your salt intake to help manage fluid retention. Stay hydrated. Maintain a healthy weight. Take proper medications that are prescribed by your doctor. And reduce stress. Your liver is a vital organ, and recognizing signs of trouble early can make a significant difference in your health outcomes. Stay vigilant, listen to your body, and don't hesitate to reach out to a healthcare professional if you have concerns about your liver health. Your well-being is worth it.